How are you doing folks? Adam Smasher93 here and welcome to Uncharted 2 Among Thieves. Now I completed the Let's Play recently on the first Uncharted game and it was an amazing experience. Currently I'm playing it on hard, off screen, also looking for the rest of the treasures in that game. But right now in the Let's Play world, I am moving on to this game. And I'm ready to continue on this Nathan Drake col collection. We're gonna play through the campaign. Also, brutal mode. Am I gonna have to beat crushing mode first? <clears throat> Anyways, we'll just play normal mode again. And yes, we'll do new save game data. Check this out. I did not tell half of what I saw, for I knew I would not be believed. Marco Polo on his deathbed, 1324. Here. Okay, a rock in a hard place. Jeez, that's a long way of climbing. Oh, crap. Oh. Yes, I know how to jump. I've done that since the first game. Yeesh. Rex train is giving me a hard time. Okay. the train holy crap and this is not a very not so memorable train ride here I think I'm almost to the top. Boy, I'm... Boy, it is so... Ow! Jeez, Nathan Drake's seen better days. And 
now it's gonna also say if there's treasure in this game, like the first game. Whoa. Wow. Buy me a drink, sailor. Harry Flynn? Hey! What the hell are you doing here? I'm looking for you, mate. Uh-oh. Should I be flattered or worried? Maybe a bit of both. <laughs> Come here. I've got a job for us. Really? The client is willing to part with a huge sum of cash if we acquire a certain object for him. All right, I'm listening. Now, you're not gonna like this. Oh, no. No, you're out of your mind. Yeah, you just, just hear me out for no, a second. Flynn, we both know two people who were killed trying to lift something out of this and place. And one who made it out. Yeah, barely. I can't do this without you, Drake. You're the only one who's cracked it, and you know better than anyone it's a two-person job. No, no, no. Three, actually. Right. And speak of the devil, here she comes now. What? Chloe Fraser. Nate. Drake. Nathan. Drake. Hello, Harry. Chloe here's one of the best drivers in the business. She'll take good care of us. I bet. Right, look. I've got it all figured out. We go in through the sewer. I'm loving it so far. That puts us in the courtyard. From there, we scale up the wall, run across the rooftops, and just drop down into the exhibit hall. Bob's your uncle. And what is worth all this trouble, I hear you ask? I didn't, but go ahead. But that's it. An oil lamp. Yeah. <laughs> it's worthless. I don't get it. Neither do we. That's why we tracked you down. Well, it sounds like you're working for a nutcase. Hmm. Some collector who's got too much time and money on his hands. And by the way, this is not worth any of it. But there's more. How's your 13th century Latin, mate? Where'd you get this? Borrowed it from the files of the nutcase. <laughs> In Trebizond, we were set upon by thieves. Father, Maffeo, and I were robbed of our greatest treasures. This was written by Marco Polo. Yes, that much we were able to work out. Unfortunately, the rest of it's nonsense. Hey, hold on. So that it should not fall into the wrong hands, I concealed my great sorrow in the unlikeliest place. The light of the great Khan shelters the fate of the Thirteen. See what I mean? It's just gibberish. He's talking about the lost fleet. Yeah. I know. Someone want to fill me in? Marco Polo leaves China with 600 passengers and 14 ships loaded down with treasure from Kublai Khan. And he lands in Persia a year and a half later with only one ship left and only 18 passengers. Now he recorded every detail of his journey, but he never told what happened to all those ships and the passengers. So, so somewhere out there, there are 13 ships loaded with the Emperor's treasure waiting to be found. Yeah, and that is what your client is after. Hey, look at this lamp. It's covered in Mongolian script. It must have been a gift from Kublai Khan. The light of the great Khan shelters the, the fate, fate of, of the 13. 13. Marco Polo hid something inside this lamp, something that pinpoints the site of the Lost Fleet. So, we're dicking this guy over, right? Damn Absolutely. straight. Absolutely. <laughs> you in then? What the hell? I mean, what could possibly go wrong? <laughs> Well, apparently you're just hinting like what happened. See a train crash. That's what went wrong. Oh, I see some treasure. And like I said, if I don't find any more treasures in, if I, if I any treasures I don't find in this let's play, I'll find off screen. In 
looks like Nathan Drake's in still in horrible condition. Than I thought. <laughs> Yowzer. Oh, what's. Let's see what's going on. I'll take that. Oh, okay. Of course it's locked. It's always locked. All right. He's alive. Yeah, you still don't know who you're messing with. Come on, Drake. Know where you're going. Okay. And that big wound there, and you still got a bunch of that strength. Fortunate, think you're in the clear and you end up getting hit with more misfortunes. Hello. Uh, <clears throat> well, so much for foreplay. You mind telling me what the hell is going on? You mean with Flynn? Yeah, you might have warned me. And missed the look on your face? Anyway, you haven't exactly made yourself easy to find. Talk about making yourself easy. Oh, you're not jealous. <laughs> Let's not forget who walked out on whom. After all, you don't get to be jealous. <laughs> Wait a minute, Chloe. If it makes you feel any better, my relationship with Flynn is strictly professional. Really? Mostly professional. Oh. When I figured out he was actually on to something, I thought you'd want to be in on the action. So what's the plan? Just like we said, we pull the heist, we find the ships, and we make off with the treasure. With Flynn? Mm-hmm. And then? And then we split the take three ways, and you and I just disappear together 
this time. I see. Until then, he can't know about us. He's gonna be pissed. He's gonna be fine. <clears throat> Trust me. All right. But Monty, he probably was pissed. But explain this. A bad feeling about those two. Am I supposed to jump here? And you're able to survive a bunch of pirates in the first game as well as Oh shit. Although this is Nathan Drake who survived pirate get pirate goons as well as undead. Another flashback. You sure you're up for this? I'd feel a lot better if I had a gun. You won't need them. A little insurance, that's all. Flynn, they're just museum guards. And we have their patrols all mapped out. Relax. Relax. <laughs> Relax. Have you ever been in a Turkish prison, mate? If we get caught, they will lock us up and throw away the sodding key. You do realize that, don't you? Better than you do. Well, you may fancy that kind of thing, but I don't. <laughs> Can't afford to make any mistakes. Yeah, and we won't. We're here. This way. So what do we do if they switch the patrols? Figure it out as we go. We cannot fumble our way through this. I don't fumble, I improvise. Oh, is that what you call it? Yeah, I'm uh, adaptable. Adaptable? You cocky bastard. <laughs> there. What did I tell you? That passage there is going to take us right under the museum. <laughs> you called it all right. You need to have a little more faith in me, chum. <laughs> okay, this one here is me. All right, remember, that tower is our only way into the exhibit. But we can't even get close with those floodlights on. We've gone over this. Just make sure you cut the power by the time we reach the second courtyard. The lights will be out. I'll have the van waiting at the rendezvous point. Just make sure you get your asses out of there in time. Fair enough. All right, enough chat. Let's do this. Right. Chloe. See you on the other side. Looking forward to it. Are you sure you know where you're going? Okay, I was trying to do this mission and it took too long, so I'm deciding... I'm gonna, I've cut that out just to show you the first mission and just call it an episode. So thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button. 
had a favorite moment in this or have an idea for a future let's play for me then let me know in the comment section below want to watch more of this or any of my let's plays want to stay up to date then go ahead and subscribe to my channel until then i'm am smasher 93 and i will see you in the next episode we will just pick up with chapter two